Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hope you're doing well. So cancer, this reading will be for you if you have any cancer placements or if you're dealing with a cancer, okay? Uh, cross watches are welcome. Please flip the roles if you need to, if you feel like it's your energy, okay? Take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. So before we get into tarot, I'll be picking three messages from the Angel Numbers book, okay? Whatever you need to hear right now, okay? Or for anything coming up, how you're feeling, okay? So we've got 492. Your angels are encouraging you to take time to breathe. Be cool, calm and collected before you move forward, okay? Definitely helpful because when things are slower, we're able to see things clearer, think about things, reflect, okay? We have 251. Your angels are encouraging you to trust in the guidance that is rising up within you. It's divinely led, okay? And this is where the first message comes into it as well. Okay, so there's something within you that the answer's already there. Just got to quiet your mind to, to get to it, okay? And the last message is 704. Your angel's presence and messages are physically manifesting around you. Open your eyes and mind to seeing things differently and, and be aware of your angel supporting you. Okay, Cancer? So those are, those are your angel numbers messages. So I'm going to pick this deck. Let's see what's going on with you, okay? So, I'll put this back. Let's see what's going on with cancers right now. What's going on with cancer, please? The Hierophant, lessons, studious energy. For me, the, the Hierophant's always studious. Lessons, could be a relationship, we'll see. The world, wow, some of you guys are completing something. Queen of Swords and the Three of Swords. So there's, there's something that's... For example, this could be literally your studies coming to an end. You finished it, you completed it. This could be a lesson. This could be um, a cycle that's been completed, okay? You've got the lesson, now you're moving forward. Now, the King of Swords and the Three of Swords, this is you being logical about um, something that hurt you, asking yourself why, you know? Asking yourself, why did you feel this way? Why did, you know, why certain things happened? And gaining that information that you need to be able to move forward, Okay? And this is quite good. This is really good for you, Cancer, because rather than going with your heart, you know, um, which is good, but <clears throat> it depends on what placements you have. It's good for you as a water sign to be logical about things and that really will balance things out. OK. Really good, actually. This feels like you've, you're gaining control over something in your life, which is amazing. OK. Right, what else could you tell me about Cancer? King of Pentacles, ooh. Okay, so for some of you guys, there is definitely, your money will be improving. I'm seeing you guys thinking about your finances, your stability, the material things that you may want, okay? The lovers, we've got Gemini there. Let me see, tell me about the lovers, please. Tell me about the lovers for Cancer. The Seven of Swords, so it could be uh, an air sign, Gemini or Aquarius there, it doesn't have to be, but this is showing me that there could have been some kind of um, distraction here with, a rela with the relationship that you had, okay, somebody wasn't who they said they were, okay, let's just say somebody ha uh, wore a false mask, okay, um, this situation, it looks like it's ended, you've gained clarity about it and you're now able to really focus on what you need to do, okay? You're really gaining a lot of control. It's got self-control, magician. And the Hierophant, wow. So if you guys are actually learning or teaching people things or this is what you will be doing. So if you guys are manifesting something as well, you're manifesting. So we've got the hermit here and the star. Wow. 
this feels like an energy that's very to themselves this feels like an energy that will be very successful okay and also this uh, there's a lot for you to share uh cancer there's something that needs to be sh shared here i do see a wish coming true for you and you know why yeah the hermit and the world is above that's really good so it has this is showing me cancer that you have gone within and you you've gained that you've come out the star so the magician the hierophant and the star so you've manifested something say you you asked for clarity or peace or guidance or uh abundance whatever it is that you've been wishing or wanting it's coming to you and i feel like whatever has been restricting you or holding you back keeping you stuck whatever that is is completed because you have gained control of 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 a situation of your emotions you understand why things are happening the way the way they they have been this is really do you know what the energy today is amazing the fall so this is you taking a chance on yourself okay it's giving you more drive more determination to move forward okay uh new challenges not worrying about what's what's in front of you not worrying about what's coming not having the anxiety over things that may not happen that may happen it's like whatever if it comes up then i'll address it as needs be okay wow i don't see you being afraid page of cups there's some kind of conversation about a business here, Cancer. There's some kind of um, communication. It could be with a water sign or an earth sign here. Okay. You have that fight in you. But your fight... Cancer. Cancer. So when I say that fight in you, I mean that drive, that ambition, okay? That drive, not so much, um, you know, verbal fight, physical fight. Do you know what I like about the Five of Swords and the Lovers? Because like the energy that I'm getting, you know, if I got a certain energy, I'd speak on it. But it's like you, you, how can I put this? Like you move forward with love, but you also, you know, you're coming from a good place. And that's why you're, that's why you're moving um, beyond whatever obstacles are coming towards you because it's coming from love wow you've really mastered something you've mastered not just something a few things here and sometimes we just need that clarity that peace that sense of direction what it is that we want to do to really give us that courage and confidence to move forward and it helps us in many areas of our life i see you doing that and we have ten of wands and above that is a seven of swords so whoever this person was that was a burden in your life or you felt like it was your responsibility, they were they were your responsibility. For some of you guys, it could be a family member. It could have been a job that was just like, no, this is too much for me now. I'm not liking the way I'm being treated. Okay, whatever that was, you're letting go of it. You are releasing it. Absolutely releasing it. You've ended that, okay? And you're transforming, okay? The Knight of, the Knight of um, Pentacles, this has been a long time coming, okay? Yeah, for some of you guys, you felt like it, take, it took quite some time for you to reach this um, headspace, this mindset, this, yeah, with the uh, Knight of Pentacles, the Hermit and the world there. You felt like it take a long... Some of you guys, you could have been doing a shadow work for quite a long time or really trying to understand what it is that you want from life or where you're heading or healing something, but it's happening. Please tell me more about cancer. The four of wands. Oh, somebody, Cancer, there may be somebody here that will, somebody sees this star potential within you. Yours, why do I feel like you're going to be, I don't feel like this is, you're a blessing in someone's, well, many people's lives, but there's someone here that's definitely seeing you as, as a really strong suitor. You have a lot of potential, okay? I'm seeing you have a lot of conversations about what you could be, who you're meant to be, okay? Some of you guys may work from home or you work in other people's homes. 
Six of Cups. Yeah. This is you releasing the past. This is you releasing the past and heartbreak. That's why you've moved forward. All right, what else could you tell me about cancer, please? Three of Cups. I'm seeing you going out more cancer. I'm seeing you celebrating yourself. Oh, the sun. Oh, my God. The readings today have been absolutely, like, so optimistic and high vibrational. I love it. All right, so I'm seeing you guys, I'm seeing some of you guys meet up with friends, celebrating things, your own achievements, other people's achievements, okay? Things that can be. I am seeing you either message a um, another water sign or earth sign, or you're just speaking about the things that you could, um, tangible things, a business, okay? Business matters. The sun, Leo energy, okay? I'm seeing you be really happy, really happy content okay some of you guys are going to be really invested in yourself you're happy that you've released whatever this is you've gained that that confidence to move forward okay absolutely beautiful i'm getting challenges that you're happy to take on like it's this is i said this in was it leo's reading very liberating this is what it feels like some of you guys could have leo in your chart we just got two leo cards there so actually you've got three so it could actually be um could actually be connected with a leo oh you could be on a cusp yeah you could be on the cusp of that so if you are definitely check the leo reading out all right guys i'm going to leave it there please like share subscribe and there you are again cancer queen of cups um Please like, share, subscribe, comment if it resonates. If you'd like a personal reading, all the information is in the description box below. Have an amazing week and I'll see you in your next reading. Bye, guys.